Right then, if you're changing the seats on your Tesla, especially at the back, you have to change the ECU. Because as you can see, when I do this button, the motor's not releasing. So what I do, I put the original motor that I had with the car, and I do the switch. So you have to, um, you have to change the motors over. So this is the one, it's my original one. Camera to bloody focus, there you go. There's the, uh, so that's the one, original one from the car. And that's the one I got from the with the seats. So just a heads up, if you uh, do change the seats in your Tesla at the back, you need to change the, the, the um, actuator modules as well, because apparently they're probably coded to the car. God knows what the front ones are going to be like when I get them. So I'm going to have to probably change the, uh, the seat ECUs on the fronts as well.